Hey guys, HF Masters here, and today we are doing a quick overview on all of Germadon's shark vehicles. Now, there are technically six of these, including the Junior's Shark Car and Garma Mecha Man, however, you could, of course, get rid of the Junior Shark Car. It's kind of a small thing, however, we decided we're going to include it, because why not? And first of all, with the exception of Garma Mecha Man, these sets are like really, really unified. They all have different numbers on them. For example, the Garmadon Shark Mech has the number 1, the Junior's Car has the number 4, Manta Ray Bomber has the number 26, and so on. And the other thing is, they've all got the same color scheme. They have the bluish gray, yellow, and a little bit of white to represent just kind of, you know, teeth. And in general, they really look like a good team. And then you have Garma Mecha Man, which is so, so different from the rest. It does kind of give it this, like, leader position. And not only that, but because these other machines were made way way before Garma Mecha Man, at least in the movie, Garma Mecha Man was something different after they attacked um, Ninjago City and they failed. And then Garma Mecha Man was made. But Garma Mecha Man literally kind of just has nothing to do with the rest of these besides the fact it's Garmadon he's leading. No numbers, different colors, completely sticks out. But I do like it. It kind of has this cool, like, leadership presence over it. A little more than I would say the uh, Garmadon Shark Mech, which the only kind of significance ha that has is, first of all, being the biggest. And, of course, it has number one on it. But not really too much of a kind of leadership presence. Garma Mecha Man really does give off that whole, this is the leader, I am the leader kind of presence and I think it works well. But overall, that's really all there is for Garmin on Shark Army. Gotta say, I do like these sets. Some of them alone, like, kinda look bland. However, all together, they really look good, and I think all of these sets are really good. But that's all I have to say. Comment below what you guys think of all these sets together. And until next time, this is HF Masters saying goodbye.